All right, bear with me a little bit here while I attempt to do this single-handed. Um, this is a reference video for the GM 4200 or the 4.2 Vortec engines. This is a reference for the ECU connectors or the engine connectors. Uh, next video will be the ECU connectors for the pinouts and the uh, colors of the wiring. For engine swaps, I have three of these. Uh, one of them is going in a 2006 Yukon Denali, and one of them is going in my 5th Gen Camaro. I'm not sure. This one is a 2002. I also have a 2005 and a 2007. Uh, we can go ahead and start here. Let's get a better view of that. There is the first page pinout. Second page pinout. These numbers right here, these are the part numbers for the connectors. In case you want to make your own harness. And there's the third page, the PCM1. I'm going to go ahead and do on another video. I haven't finished writing that all down. So we'll go ahead and start with the camshaft actuator solenoid. That is this one right here. We have pin A is going to be brown and that's the control. And pin B is going to be black and that's the low reference. Uh, let's see, brown's going to be this one, so it would be pin A and pin B. The next one is going to be the camshaft position sensor. It goes right there. Let's pull it off. Uh, we have pin A is red, pin 2 is brown with a white stripe, and pin C is pink with a black stripe. Black stripe. That's 12 volts, signal, and low reference. It's A, B, and C. Next one is the crank position sensor. They have two different crank position sensors on these engines, depending on the year. I believe the 08 and 09 have the three wire, and everything previous to that has the two wire. The two wire is the VR sensor, and the three wire is the hull. We have pin A is purple, pin B is yellow, low reference and signal. Let's see, purple. So I guess that would be pin A and pin B. Next up is the coolant temperature sensor. And I believe that is right here. I have yellow is pin A. And then pin B is, let's uh, pin B is black and that's the lower reference, so A and B. Fuel injectors are under this intake. I'm not gonna take the intake off yet. There is a kind of an inline harness connector for the fuel injectors. Fuel injectors are pretty easy. It's basically you put 12 volts to them and the ECU controls the trigger. So fuel injectors one through six, pin A's are always gonna be the 12 volt and the pin B's are gonna be the uh, ECU controls. We got oxygen sensor next up. This is just sensor one, not sensor two, because sensor two is for the cat and we don't need to deal with that. We have pin A is gonna be tan. Looks like we got tan is right here and purple. So it'd be pin A, B, C, and D, I think. Let's see, green. Yeah, dark green. So a, B, C, and D. Ignition coils. The 2007 engine that I have, I am running the LS ignition coils. Uh, these are three wire. The LSs are four wire. One of the wires on the LS coils, you don't need. That just goes back to the ECU to say if there is a coil fault. All these are going to be... Let's see. A, B, and C. So, A, B, and C. A is the power, the 12 volt. Uh, C is the ground, and B is going to be the ECU trigger of the coil. Intake air temp. That's this right here. 
We have a tan and black. The tan is the signal. Focus, come on. So we have A and B. Knock sensor. We're looking for a light blue and gray. There's two knock sensors. This is the second one. There's the first one over there. We have A and B. That'd be light blue and gray. That'd be on the sensor two. Sensor one would be dark blue for the signal. And the next, the last one we have, I believe. No, we got to throw out a body next. Last, uh, second to last one we have is the map sensor. Located up here. Orange, light green, and gray. So it'd be A, B, and C. That would be the low reference, the signal, and the 5 volt. The throttle body, I'm not going to do the entire readout on the pinout of that. Let's see, A is dark green. So this one would be A, B, C, and D, E, F, G, and H as you're looking at the connector. So once again, I'll show you the pinout on paper with the connector part numbers focus come on there we go give you time to press pause take a look at that and here's the third one like i said i'm going to do an ecu connector pin out on the next one i just haven't finished writing down all that but there's for the throttle body